No doubt you step outside, you feel the heat and the humidity. We've been in the dog days of summer and this heat wave, this dangerous heat wave continues. You can see the highs over the past week, upper 80s to low and mid 90s. And for the past few days, we've had heat advisory conditions where it's been that combination of heat and humidity that make it so tough to do anything outside during the afternoon. Well, guess what? Looking ahead this afternoon, Saturday and Sunday, we have something new and more serious to talk about, and that's an excessive heat warning. So what's the difference? Well, a heat advisory is posted when those heat index values are expected to reach 105 to 110 degrees. When it gets over 110, you factor in those temperatures and the humidity, and it feels like it's over 110, there you have an excessive heat warning. And that's the case for Hampton Roads through the upcoming weekend. You will notice the eastern shore, the outer banks, and the northern neck are under heat advisory Everybody else in our viewing area is under the excessive heat warning. Now, one interesting note, the criteria for the heat advisories and the excessive heat warnings, it's based on the region. So areas farther north where they don't get as hot, those thresholds might be 100 degrees or a little bit lower, while down to the south, you take a look like Norfolk, we have 105 and 110 degrees for the cutoffs, well, down through Dallas and say Atlanta, they have similar thresholds. They also look at just the daytime highs. So it really depends on the region. That's the bottom line on heat advisories and excessive heat warnings. Stay cool this weekend and remember your hot weather safety tips.